Another month goes by with no uploads. This time, a game takes the blame. Warframe. Those who've played it know exactly why. This game is both a perfectionist's dream and nightmare with hundreds to thousands of weapons and items to collect hundreds of challenges, and a total of 193 Steam achievements. A lot of these achievements are easy to unlock, but to get them all, you need thousands of hours because you basically need to 100% Warframe itself. I wish I could have maybe done a video like that from scratch, but I started playing Warframe in early 2015, and I really had no intention of restarting that progress. With over 700 hours in the game now, I'm reaching closer and closer to getting the achievements, so today, I decided to single 11 achievements out for this video. These achievements will bring me to a staggering, massive, 91% completion on Steam. We start with the achievement, The Eightfold Path, which requires me to survive eight waves of defense using nothing but melee weapons. Seems pretty easy, it's just something I don't really do, so I can just unequip my guns, I guess. That said, using only melee, I guess I can't really use any Warframe abilities, so maybe this wasn't the correct call to uh, pick this frame. I should have put on more defense or something. You know, Warframe's one of those games where once you start playing, you never let it go. I can't even, I don't even know if I'd recommend it to everyone or not, because, you know, I kind of lost a month of YouTube time playing it, which I apologize for. But, you know, I'm addicted, so. Now, I'm taking a little bit of damage, but even if I have to revive, I should be okay. That was wave... Are we on wave three? We're on wave... We are on wave four already. Before anyone asks, I will not be only playing this game now. I am going to stick to my old schedule again. I want to hopefully get a video up at least once a week again. That would be more than nice. I'm kind of rambling at this point, so let's just do these achievements. Ah! I'd really prefer if I didn't die, just in case that affects the achievement. Ah! You know, I'm on wave 8. Didn't pop. Maybe I have to beat wave 8. Ah, don't die! Yeah! There it is. We must survive 8 waves of defense using only melee attacks. The next achievement is a railjack one. It's to pilot a hijacked enemy cruise ship during the railjack mission, which I guess I'm not that surprised I haven't done that because I rarely play any railjack, as you can see. I'll probably have to wait for an encounter. All right, uh, pilot this bad boy. There we go. We just have to find a cruise ship, call one in or whatever you do. Look at these low levels, one shot them all. Oh wait, that's a cruise ship right there. Pray our thing doesn't get blown up while we're out there. In, 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 we go in. Sneak on, sneak aboard, yes. So where do you pilot this? Ah, I see, he's the pilot. And now, hell yeah, that's so cool, what the hell. I am the captain now. The next set of achievements, all have to do with the open world. Starting with the Earth one, the Plains of Edelon. Oh, it's already night. Perfect, because I have to survive an entire night on the Plains of Edelon. Okay, one more minute until it's nighttime. I believe we should hear something before it turns to nighttime. Also, I switched frames because you have to survive. If you die once, you don't get the achievement. So it's a bit of a stressful one because it takes an hour, you know? It might take even longer than an hour. Oh. The alarms. You know, I don't really know what I'm going to be doing in the open world for an hour, and but I guess I'll just try to survive. One death, you lose, so. I'll have to try again if I don't get it. Probably just stack over shields with my abilities so I don't die. And then I'll just hide or something. I don't know. It's not like it used to be dangerous, but I mean, I don't think it's very dangerous anymore. So the, yeah, nighttime means scarier enemies, more buff enemies. And we already got 2000 over shields. Yeah, I already don't think I'm going to die at this over shield level, but I want to get it to like 15k. Where should I hide? That's what I want to know. Okay, maybe I'll go like... I'll go here. Yeah, no one will find me down here, right? <laughs> perfect. Now I watch YouTube for the next 47 minutes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is supposed to be a high effort video. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be one of these. But I mean, most of the achievements I was missing are just like... The ones where you gotta just run in a straight line. For a long period of time. And I guess, as you can see, this one too, where you gotta just sit still for five, five zero minutes. One hour later. Guys, I swear I've been, I've been stealthing around for the full hour. It's gonna end any second now. 
Three, two, one. Yes, okay. We survived the night. Well, I do have to explore every Edelon cave. Oh, there's one right here, I guess. Let's see how many I'm close to, because I've been in these caves before. Where is it? Where is it? I'm uber confused. Is it like an elevator somewhere? It should be right. Oh. Aha. Okay. I mean, there's no way I've been in this freaking cave. So I have no idea how to even access it. That was it. That was. Yeah. Okay. Well, that, that wasn't even a cave. That counts. So. Well, at this point, I've definitely been in this cave. So hopefully that counts. I'm just going to assume I've been in this cave before. That's why no, like, progression is popping. If you go into the profile. And then challenges. And then you go into miscellaneous, I'm assuming. Tomb looter. I am one cave off. They could pop right when I touch the very tip of the cave, basically. So I could just bump into a bunch of caves and and hopefully it will uh, you know, just give me the achievement straight up. This side should have some caves, according to the map I'm looking at. I see one right there. Let's fly right in. Oh, that was the one! What a random cave. It's a whole lot of nothing, but you know. I've got to kill a hundred plains beasts. I have no idea how I'm going to do that. Alright, I've watched a video on how to do this part. It's not going to be fun. So you walk out, then you walk back in. And there should be a couple planes beasts that I can just kill right off the bat. I'm not really seeing where. It might have to be daytime. I think nighttime has screwed me completely. Oh, wait! I, I guess those don't count. Alright. Wait, do these... Oh, there they go! I kind of feel bad, but you know achievements you know how it is so now if i wanted to i could just leave and re-enter and hunt those same guys down over and over yeah this is where i speed it up like a thousand times the speed it should be going right now I just traveled a hundred thousand meters? What? I didn't even mean to do that. But well, that is awesome. Ninety-nine? Oh. There we go. One hundred. Wasn't as long as I thought it'd be, to be honest. Maybe like 20 minutes. Apparently we gotta go to... Hillside Rune. Which is this way. Right there. Finally. Tusk, Dargan, whatever the hell you would call it. Now we fly around for a very long time. This thing is massive. I thought these were way smaller. Okay, they're mad at me. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Fly away. No. Oh, why is this so hard to control? Okay, 1,000 down. I think I already had some progression in that, but judging by how fast I'm going around the map, 10,000 should be a breeze. Oh, that was easy. This thing was way faster than I thought it'd be. And we fall. The reason why I brought Volt, my Evangelion looking Volt, is because we need to travel 500 meters in a single slide across the plains of Edelon. And I have no idea how I'm, I'm possibly going to do that. Like, I might as well try going as fast as possible. Like, there's no way this is not fast enough. 500 meters? Wait, hold on. It's looking good already. Oh! Uh! No! 
Don't bump into the tree. No, my momentum. I mean, I could just keep going. I could keep trying until I get it. We got to be at the very top of this right here, maybe. Go. No, look at all the rocks. No. Okay. No, left. Left. Yes. No, we're already slowing down. Keep going. Keep going, no! Keep going! Keep going! You get momentum, and then watch. Okay, I lost all my momentum all at the same time, but we can give this a shot. This mountain's really crazy. How? How did I just lose all my momentum? Don't hit the rock. Don't hit the rock! Oh my goodness. This looks good. I just don't know how this is possible. Don't hit the rock. Don't hit the rock. Don't hit the rocks. Are we still going? I think we're still going. How am I not going faster? Go faster. Go faster. Yes. Down the hill. Yes. Yes. Okay. We're still going. I don't know if I stood up during this or not. But I think we're looking good. Definitely gonna hit this rock. No! There we go. There we go. Look at that. Okay, I, I really don't understand how I lose all momentum, like, immediately. Now I got Arc Wing capabilities. Look at that. Why? Why do you slide all the way to the left? And then why am I losing so much momentum? There's only one more hope. Launching myself 500 meters forward with the Volt buff, Arc Wing. Go all the way out. Oh my god, look at my speed. I'm already touching, okay. And then... Look at that! I'm flying! Holy smokes! Okay. Yeah! <laughs> That's the... Easiest way possible to do that. I love it. Thank you, Bolt. I knew I was right bringing you. And the other ones, they're on Orb Vallis, which is the second open world area. Okay, well, to start, I gotta complete six bounties within 60 minutes in Orb Vallis. Okay. I mean, if I do the lowest level one every time, I should easily get that. No, no, no. I'm gonna get a better frame. Let's use... how about Mag? Let's rock Mag. She'll be able to one-shot everything in the area really fast. Boom, boom, bam. That's another bunch dead. Boom, boom, bam. That's more dead. I need energy. Anyone want to drop me energy, please? Oh, I got energy at some point. I better not be looking for caches. No, it's just a simple spy mission. Oh, this will be such an easy achievement if I can focus and get that done. I gotta hack the alarms, guys. Oh, jeez. I'm trolling. I'm actually trolling. Get up, damn it. Get the hell up! What are you... What the hell? I don't actually want to lose. Come on. Die. There. Jeez, that was closer than comfort, okay? No more trolling. Well, this is already only three minutes. So, I'm definitely, uh... I'm definitely gonna get this done if I don't take ten minutes per one. Oh, this is a longer one, actually. Alright, that's one down. Now we teleport fast. Uh, where the hell is it? Where the hell is it? Where the hell is it? Right here. We start another one. Same one. Boop, and boop. Yeah! We've done it. Six bounties. Within 60 minutes. Completed. Next. Back at Fortuna, or Orvalis, or whatever you want to call it. We have to explore all the caves. 
once again, but in a different area, I guess. I don't know how many I'm off. Oh my god, there's 30 caves out in this place. Another 21 is needed. Time for the grind, I guess. It doesn't even show you where all the caves are at. No! Alright, I pulled up a map. Let's get this started, I guess, from the bottom right of the map to the bottom left, I guess. I have an assumption. Only the maps I haven't explored are the ones that don't appear on the map. So I just have to follow this guy's completed map. And I should be able to do it pretty easily. Oh, it's right here. It's actually on the map. Okay, so I just have to, like, go near them. And they pop. Right over here. Okay. Where's the entrance? Here. This counts as a cave? It doesn't count as a cave for me, I guess. I feel like this is the first one I got. Let me just check. Okay, maybe not. Um, Last one is behind Fortuna, actually. That was way easier than I thought it'd be. I thought I'd like miss one or something. But the maps are very precise. This should be the last one. Over here, maybe? Somewhere? Uh, down here? Yeah. Nice! Nice! Easy achievements. How about we wrap this video up with this achievement here. Every single K-Drive race in the Orb Valis. That will be a bit of a grindy one. And I don't even know where all the races are at. I'm gonna have to pull up a whole other map just for that. Okay, holy smokes, there's a lot. Like, I'm gonna put the map on screen now just so you can see. Every single one of those purple dots that's a race I gotta complete. So it turns out the ones on the map right now, they're the only K-Drive races available per day because they refresh five every 24 hours and you could get unlucky and get the same ones every 24 hours. Like, if you're really unlucky, of course. So unfortunately, I will not be able to get the achievement today, but I will do the ones that are currently there right now. All right, here we go. First, first race. I'm probably so bad at these. Oh. Oh. No way I have to go through the city. Oh no, lost all my momentum. The thing is, you only have to complete them. You don't need a specific time. Though there is a time limit. Let me hit the gritty. Oh yeah. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, it's right there. Oh no. Hit it, please. Don't go over it. <laughs> Good, it's a straight path. Of course, the one hard part I choke at. Roam. 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 Oh, no. Okay. Three out of 22. I've only done two raises total, see? Boom. Boom. Nice slide. Nice reversal. This one is not the easiest, because it's in a cave. Why did I jump? Why did I jump? I actually wiped out. Get up! Oh my god. Don't go- What?! Little cheeky mother trucker. Yeah, another easy peasy one. And there should be one more at the bottom. Yeah, right down here by Spaceport. Right up here. All right, final race of the video, not the achievement. I'll just have to do this on my own time, I guess. Boom! You know, I mean, I'm a lot of uh, races off the achievement, but you can't say I didn't put in the effort. Well, that, I guess that's it for the video. I am currently sitting at 91% of all of the achievements in this game. That is so crazy to me. But I mean, I do have this many hours, somewhere somewhere like 720? I, I don't know. When this video drops, it could be more. Who knows? But I'm going to put the game down for now. And we're going to play some more games for the channel, okay? I'm going to revive the channel, okay? Stay tuned. Shouldn't be long till the next upload. Thanks for watching. And I will see you very, very soon.